I'll admit, I'm starting to hate this battle just because every time I get, you know, his growl to sleep, it basically instantly wakes back up. Which is driving me nuts. I can't even get past his first Pokemon so far. Because he keeps waking up and throws around Fire Blast, which just devastate my team for obvious reasons. Like, either they're fragile because they're ghost types, or, you know, they're super vulnerable to, you know, the Fire Blast. And the only way I can really counter that would be to maybe drop in Venom and try and go for uh, a bunch of double teams, but that is not a great plan. Like, one, he'll probably wake up too early. For me to get set up in time. And two, let's face it, one Fire Blast and we're dead. Well, we can see if we get lucky this time, I guess. I mean, I could have definitely gone for a curse set up here. Yep, instant death. I just cannot get the luck I need, I swear. And I really need luck this battle. Ugh, sleep powder. Put you back to sleep. And switch in, uh, Pamela, I guess. No, my luck, he'll wake up and go for another freaking fire blast. Okay, finally got some decent sleeps off, I guess. Nope, woke up and bit us to death. Gosh darn it! Like, trying to stack effects here has been next to impossible. And uses a Hyper Potion, because of course he has a Hyper Potion. That's why I've been trying to set up other Pokemon, but every time I try and set up on this damn thing, it wakes the bleep up. It's like, stay the... Stay asleep, you damn bloody mess. That way I can, you know, get stuff done. Okay, stay asleep. Switch out, because now we got some health recovery going. Pokemon, um, drop Lapis, I guess. If it gets hit by Fire Blast, it's just dead. I mean, let's face it. And I haven't seen a Fire Blast miss yet in this damn thing. Which is getting really annoying, because it shouldn't be this accurate. Ugh. Just die. Seriously, Grawl, just die already. Sad part is this isn't going to be worth that much experience. Like, it's just been eating up tons of our uh, guys. Because it just never stays down. And I know it's really intimidating. It makes no sense when they keep waking up so fast. Get the seat off. Problem is, it also knows Fire Blast, because all his Pokemon know Fire Blast. And I really need Killer to survive. Okay, get off a curse. Hopefully, don't wake up. Okay, curse, do your thing. Confuse Ray. A bit risky, I know. Gosh darn it! Couldn't even get the self smack. Ugh. Curse, take it out. Of course, he has another hyper potion. Well. I can get a turn of setup at least. But we haven't even got to his worst team members yet, and I have literally no Pokemon besides my Venusaur and uh, and Lapras. It's like, gosh darn it! Just 
just growl and hope, you know, it doesn't wake up. Ugh, I should have just switched out, uh, my ghost type, because then I could have let, uh, I'm Cold drop, you know, Curse on Rapidash, maybe. Or got a move off. Gosh darn it! Can I seriously just get a Fire Blast miss? Like, I haven't seen one miss yet. It's like, it makes no sense. This move should not be this devastating this consistently. Freaking Sleep Powder it again. Trying to get another uh, use out of it, bro. Not that that's gonna help. Oh, finally a miss. Of course, they can still one shot us if it connects. <sighs> Just try and keep this thing, you know. Disabled, hopefully long enough to win. Man, this is why this run is both ex ex exciting, I guess, to watch and an absolute nightmare to play. We're counting so much on luck to carry us, you know. Oh, we got another lucky miss. Thank you. Why is it all coming in the late part of this this battle? I don't know. Of course we missed that leech the uh, freaking sleep powder. Get put back on death's door. Probably get burned too, right? Well, it shouldn't wake up instantly, so we will be back up to 57 HP. Come on. I'm hoping we can just land a freaking uh, Parish Song before it knocks us out. I don't care if it intimidates me. It missed the Fire Blast? Okay, that probably just screwed it. Potentially. Because that's probably going to one-shot kill her. Critical hit, so yeah, guaranteed death at that point. Okay, bring out the leech. Well, if we can sleep it, we win. Most likely. Evade the attack, fast asleep, Parish Scout's gonna hit zero and he'll die. Okay. That was, uh, tense. Oof. But, you know, at least he's out of the way, finally. Ugh, it took everything we had, though, basically. Yes, Fire Blast. I can't even use it. Well, that'll do it for this episode. Next time, we'll go to Viridian Sea and start working on that gym. Until then, see ya.